welcome ladies and gentlemen welcome back to my youtube channel today i am super excited to show you a payment app i have been working on um Omoluabi. yeah it's a, a that's um a nigerian name instead of Omoluabi, so we use Omoluabi. this particular mobile application was built from scratch using flutter and firebase so if you have ever used apps like Ope, pampe um kuda pay um, different uh, payment service on in Nigeria or in other countries, uh, you will know how seamless mobile payments can be. So I wanted to replicate that experience and I'm going to walk you through how I built it and what feature it has. So this app was built entirely using Flutter for the front end and Firebase handles the back end. Everything from authentication to real-time database storage and cloud function, history, security features, OTP, PIN, Face ID, fingerprints, everything it is packed on this Uwoluabi. So then from our splash screen, it leads direct us to our onboarding screen. Keep from onboarding screen to, the, to log either the register as a new user or the login to their account so i already selected nigeria as you can see we selected morocco morocco is going to be ticked but i will select my country nigeria so the you can see notice the um country code is changing from here so now let me put in my phone number uh 43 45 44 16 46 46 46 so this is also my whatsapp number so let's click on continue Okay, so now we are asking for first name. So uh, this so um, the username is going to be Ademide. Sorry, Ademide. So the Gmail. So let's. I am sending the Gmail. So let me use um Ademide at gmail dot com. So let's click on continue. So this is where we are going to input our address. So let me just put um let me just put some uh Lucas. So this also put some dummy code so I'm gonna put okay, navigate through this particular site. So here is where you can input our pin. So this pin will be used for transaction purposes. So you can set up your pin here. It is maximum of four four ping okay so uh, click on confirm then we'll be directed to where we should verify our kyc verification and our user can skip it for later so let us um fill our kyc here so we are using this um to float bar calendar okay so it will report how to implement all this from scratch so let us select our national id and um let me put a random number here and the next thing now is to select the image of our id card so i'll just select a random image So now this is our dashboard. So here you can see we have the um, username there. That they have the name and the phone number that we um that we input when we stuff for an for an account. So here is here where we are trying to notify our users to verify their KYC verification. So now welcome to Ogoluabi. So this is the user dashboard where they can see the account balance where they can add money, send money, cash out their money from the account balance, um, send emails and request money from, from other users. So here yeah, also supports QR code. You can scan another person QR code to send them money or scan a merchant's QR code to, to make payments. 
So you can recharge um your mobile. You can recharge a time. So let's click on the recharge a time. Okay. So before we can do anything, we need to make sure so uh, we verify our KYC verification. So let us let us verify our KYC verification on the admin panel. So now let's navigate to the admin panel. So here, yeah. okay, this is our this is our admin panel. Okay. So here yeah, we go, we are going to navigate to our users okay so let's go to our users so we're going to manage our users and um we're going to click on kyc on verified so if any user registered and they did not verify their kyc you can see this is our account the user is the user will show up on this screen so now let us verify the user kyc and user to a verification sources okay so now let's go back to the app and um let us refresh so let's go back home and then let's refresh so now as you can see the error the um, notification is not there anymore that means we have verified our kyc so now let me fund these accounts so you can fund your user account. So let me fund this account with five. So this particular amount. And let me give it a uh, okay, transaction from ABA Bank. So let me submit this. And then um, boom. The money will reflect on our dashboard here. So this is the money here. So now the next thing now is let us click on the airplane. So here we can select our okay. We should select our country. My country here is Nigeria. So you can select other countries, okay? So we are using Nigeria as example here. So this is like my country here. So I select Nigeria. Then I select my operator. Either it is Ed Salads, um, Etel, Glow, MTN. So let me click on MTN. Okay, so let me put my number here. So I can select in back hundred one thousand. So let me say like Android for now. So, um, uh, so I will need to input my pin for verification purpose. So I have input my pin. I need to hold this to confirm. Then that's all. So I now have money in my reload uh, wallet. Is it there? So this is my reload wallet. Okay. So. If I switch it back to the um to the live section, you can see that there is no money here. So I have to fund this reload bal uh, balance so that my user will be able to buy airtime on their accounts here. So the after in the airtime section is working perfectly, and you can also send money to other users. Okay, so let me select. A particular user on our on our back end so then I click on active users all the active users will be shown here so let me send money to Oluwaye okay so okay it has it has asked for and um, contact access so let me send money to Oluwaye okay by click on continue here we can see this is the Oluwaye you can see this is a picture uh, as it is here, I do the Enoch, and this is the picture. So, this is it here also. I do the Enoch at the picture. So, it's recognized this particular user through their username. So, now you can send money to users by their username or by their phone number. So, you click on next, then you put your PIN. Once you click on confirm, you will need to click and hold to send the money. Perfect. The money has been sent successfully. So now you can go back home. And now you will see 
the reason transaction at your our on our on our dashboard yeah so you can see this is the money that was added to your account this is the money that you sent to Oluwaye in percentage you can see this is how it's work here and um you can view all in stream yeah so this is our our tab bar where we can edit our profile profile information and other section here why here is our bank statements where we can see all the history of what we have been doing so far on our on our account so here is the history also this is where we are going to be generating if we want to check uh, more information or report a transaction i just click on the transaction id and um, we're going to navigate to support here so support tickets you can submit support tickets here you can click on create okay so you put the id like we just copied here then you set it to i and then you put your image and you submit so in within 24 within 24 hours or even within 10 minutes our our support um, system are going to reply you immediately so this is our app preference where you can select english or other languages that you want they want the app to display for you so we have privacy settings notification settings also where you that can turn on their notification centers okay so yeah well, this is where you can edit your um your accounts they're going to put in your profile image and other stuff so this is a fully fully built um flutter app okay so yeah you can send money you can request money you can do back transfer okay so using the back transfer this is we have gt bank we have zenith bank we have fcnb wema bank united bank so you can just by search for um gt bank so this is gt bank here okay so i will i will click on transfer now account number so i'll put the account name the account number then i will continue so that also make transactions to other bank so here yeah, is my copy now so we haven't added any organization yet so we have education we have donation we have different type of features on this our app so this is where user can add money to their account using third uh, party payments method like ipal perfect money stripe pay stack flutter wave resort pay and order okay so we have Instagram Mojo, we have authorized, we have to check out Excel commerce and and the rest. So now this is where um it gets interesting. This is our promotion, this is our promotional banner. We can click on any of them. Let's click on this one that says send money. So we can click on this to start sending money to our loved one immediately. Okay, immediately. So this is how this mobile application work. Uh will be dropping the source code where you can get the full source code of this mobile application on the description uh, section below just do well and check the description section so you can get the full source code of this um, mobile application and um, documentation will be added on the on the source code so that you'll be able to run it without any issue and um, once you have a source code you can send us a DM so we install it for you for free so we we do free installation for all our users so this project taught me so much about mobile fintech development and i hope it's inspired you to build something awesome too if you want a full studio or source code walkthrough so you check the comments the, the description section and i will also be in the comment section trying to reply your comments so don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon if you are into app developments, especially Flutter and Firebase projects like this. See you in the next one. Thank you.